Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming a video showing you how I remove my makeup and the products that I use on my face um, just to wash it, to moisturize it, and make it good. Let's jump right in. This right here is the deep action exfoliating scrub you can find this one at target so this one's actually my most used as you can see i'm almost out of that one so this next one i picked up at tilly's they had this charcoal peel off mask that i recently have been using this one is very good as well it was only ten dollars this next one i purchased online i got it for about five dollars only paid for tax and i got free shipping this next one i picked up at tj maxx this is called the dead sea origins it's just a mud mask and it even came with a little applicator i actually um, have been using them for maybe about a year now before i get everything started i don't think i can wash my face like this be right back okay much better the first step in removing my makeup i like to take off my eyelashes so here's one look at the difference oh my goodness then this next one all right see the difference that that made oh my goodness and people wonder why we need eyelashes i first remove my eyebrows my eyeshadow and then uh go on to the foundation oh my goodness eyeshadow is next So if you guys can see here, one side of the wipey is halfway full, so I use the other side. Actually, I will go back to this side and grab one of the empty parts, take off my lip gloss. Okay, and then the back side that is not really used for the foundation. I only use one wipey to remove most of my makeup so the rest of the products actually do all the work for you if you had fake eyelashes on make sure that you guys remove all that eyelash glue on the side that is one of my biggest pet peeves is having eyelash glue it gets really really stuck to the side of your eyelashes so there you have it that was most of my makeup removed in one dirty wipey all right let's get started so i'm gonna start off by using this one this one i really really like it's an exfoliating scrub um, i just use um three of my fingers or two of my fingers just to, um, put it out all around my face so i usually get about this much doesn't seem like a lot. I mean, it's on your full face. So I usually um, start off like this, rub it around, and then put it all over my face. I recommend that if you guys are using cold water, uh, just to know that it will feel super duper fresh. You'll get like a little tingling sensation all over. But if you don't like that, just use warmer water. Alright, 
so that was the deep action exfoliating scrub this one is so so good recommend the next one i'm going to be showing you guys is the nxn whole set but i won't be showing you guys all of it because some of it is for the morning and a lot of it is like a nighttime routine so I'm just going to be showing you guys a morning one right now. It comes with this inside. It's a 30 day challenge is what they call it. It shows you guys the morning routine and the nighttime routine right here. And it just kind of talks about them. All four of the products and what they're for. So we're going to be using this one first. So I did like four little squirts. And going to put it all over the face. This one feels so, so good. And it smells freaking delicious. Okay, so now that I applied it all over my face, it recommends that you leave it on your face for about two to three minutes. To remove this one, I'm actually going to be using warm water as well. The next step for the NXN was a zero gravity whip day cream. So it looks like this. All of them have a cute little pump like that. So it's a lot easier to, to use. Again, it was like four or five squirts. I don't know. Do it around. Mm -hmm. This one's just um, cream. So moisturize your face. This is the most simple daytime routine that you guys can use. It's just two products and that's basically it. You use the gel to milk cleanser, wash it off, and then the day cream and then bravo, you're done. This next one is the Dead Sea Origins. It's just a mud mask. And like I said, we have the applicator right there. And it's gray. So after you left it on for 10 minutes, just turn on the warm water, wash it off, and then use a cloth to pat on your face as well. And this one is it's very thick, so as I'm taking it off, I'm using circular motion, and then whatever is on my hands, I'm washing it off. This one is one of the messiest ones that I have, but I do like it because after you're done using it, your face feels very, very smooth. For this one, I don't have an applicator, so I just put it on my hands and then put it around my face.
So this is what I have after 20 minutes. Now it is completely dry, so let's just take it off. That is how I remove my makeup and I also showed you guys the products that I like to use on a daily basis. I did go back and use the day cream on my face after I took off the charcoal peel off. So there you have it. Okay, if you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any recommendations for my face. Help a sister out, please. All right, guys. See you guys soon. Love you. Don't forget to subscribe.